Hello friends, welcome to my YouTube channel Nightingale. Today we are going to deal with questions and answers about gastrointestinal system. We can see the questions and answers one by one. And the first question is, length of esophagus is, the options are 25 cm, 30 cm, 20 cm and 35 cm. Length of esophagus and the answer is 25 cm. Second question, capacity of stomach at birth. The options are 1 ounce, 2 ounce, 3 ounce and 4 ounce. Capacity of stomach at birth. And the answer is 1 ounce. 1 ounce means 30 ml. Next question. Alpha cells of pancreas produce. The options are insulin, lipase, glucagon and protease. Alpha cells of pancreas produce. And the answer is glucagon. The alpha cells produce glucagon and beta cells of pancreas produce insulin and delta cells produce somatostatin. You can see the next question. Surgical management commonly used for GERD. GERD means gastroesophageal reflux disease. The options are Ports procedure, Billroth procedure, Ramstead procedure and Nissen fundo application. And the answer is Nissen fundo application. In this procedure, surgeon wrap the top of the stomach around the esophagus and this reinforces the lower esophageal sphincter, make it less likely that acid will back up in the esophagus. The surgical management for GERD is Nissen fund application. The next question, necrotizing ulcerative gingivitis is known as, the options are Vincent angina, Jones angina, oral candidiasis and none of the above. Necrotizing ulcerative gingivitis is otherwise known as and the answer is Vincent's angina. Next question. Most important toxic agent cause hepatic encephalopathy. The options are carbon dioxide, nitrogen, ammonia, sulfur dioxide. Most important toxic agent cause hepatic encephalopathy. And the answer is ammonia. And the hepatic encephalopathy is loss of brain function when a damaged liver does not remove toxins from the blood. Next question. Most common type of hepatitis responsible for epidemic in India. The options are hepatitis A, hepatitis B, hepatitis C and hepatitis E. Most common type of hepatitis responsible for epidemic in India. And the answer is hepatitis E. Next question. Normal portal venous pressure. The options are 2 to 5 mm of Hg, 5 to 10 mm of Hg, 10 to 15 mm of Hg and 15 to 20 mm of Hg. Normal portal venous pressure. And the answer is 5 to 10 mm of Hg. The portal venous pressure is the blood pressure in the hepatic portal vein. Next question. Increase the alpha fetoprotein seen in. The options are angiosarcoma, hepatoblastoma, neuroblastoma and meningioma. Increase the alpha fetoprotein seen in. And the answer is hepatoblastoma. The hepatoblastoma is a malignant liver cancer occurring in the infants and children. And the next question, rat tail appearance on barium salo examination seen in? The options are acalasia cardia, carcinoma esophagus, hiatus hernia and esophageal varices. Rat tail appearance on barium salo examination seen in? And the answer is acalasia cardia. It is a Neurodegenerative disorder of esophagus resulting in defective peristalsis and impaired relaxation of esophageal sphincters. And next question, pseudo kidney sign on USG seen in? The options are CA bladder, CA colon, CA stomach and CA kidney. Pseudo kidney sign on USG. And the answer is CA stomach. 
we can see the next question the kissing ulcer seen in and the options are lesser curvature of stomach gastric androm first part of duodenum and second part of duodenum the kissing ulcer seen in and the answer is first part of duodenum the kissing ulcer seen in first part of duodenum the next question the client with chronic gastritis is at risk of which vitamin deficiency the options are vitamin a vitamin b12 vitamin c and vitamin e the client with the chronic gastritis is at the risk of which vitamin deficiency and the answer is vitamin b12 in the case of chronic gastritis the stomach cannot properly absorb vitamin b12 because of the weakened stomach lining and the next question which medication has to be avoided on a patient with acute gastritis the options are digoxin furosemide indomethacin and propranolol which medication has to be avoided on a patient with acute gastritis and the answer is indomethacin indomethacin is an nsaid nsaids are capable of producing injury to gastrointestinal mucosa the next question non bilious vomiting seen in and the options are induced assumption pyloric stenosis intestinal obstruction and gall bladder stones non bilious vomiting seen in the options are induced assumption pyloric stenosis intestinal obstruction and gall bladder stones and the answer is pyloric stenosis next question a mucosal barrier fortifier which accelerate the gastric ulcer healing the options are randa omeprazole sucralfate and antacids a mucosal barrier fortifier which accelerate the gastric ulcer healing and the answer is sucralfate and the next question commonest cause of pancreatitis the options are smoking alcoholism diet high in fat and abdominal trauma commonest cause of pancreatitis pancreatitis is an inflection of inflammation of pancreas and the answer is alcoholism and the next question bacterial flora of colon synthesize the options are vitamin d vitamin a vitamin b and vitamin k the bacterial flora of colon synthesize the options are vitamin d vitamin a vitamin b and vitamin k and the answer is vitamin b we can see the next question the rowsing sign seen in the options are malabsorption syndrome ulcerative colitis crohn's disease and acute appendicitis the rowsing sign seen in the answer is acute appendicitis in the case of acute appendicitis palpation of left lower quadrant of person's abdomen increases the pain felt in the right lower quadrant of abdomen that is rowsing sign the next question position given for a patient admitted with suspected ruptured appendix the options are semi follows position prone position supine position and lying position the position given for a patient admitted with suspected ruptured appendix and the answer is semi follows position next question normal color of stoma the options are brick red pink pink to bright red none of the above the question is normal color of stoma and the answer is pink to bright red normal color of stoma is pink to bright red. the next question diet prescribed for hemorrhoids in acute exacerbation the options are high roughage low roughage high protein and low protein diet prescribed for hemorrhoids in acute exacerbation and the answer is low roughage diet the next question organ of the body have greater width and length 
the options are cecum colon ilium and duodenum organ of the body have greater width and length and the answer is cecum the next question which blood group is more susceptible for acid peptic disease the options are o positive ab negative ab positive and o negative which blood group is more susceptible for acid peptic disease and the answer is o positive the 25th and last question most specific indicators to diagnose pancreatitis the options are amylase protease gastrin and lipase most specific indicators to diagnose pancreatitis and the answer is amylase thank you for watching please subscribe my channel for more videos